So as Christians, can God become somebody that's weak, that's unintelligent, that is feeble, that doesn't have a clue what's going on? By virtue of God's omnipotence, yes. Bro, I'm struggling to understand how an all-powerful could be a feeble old woman. <laughs> so, as Christians... Okay, that's a short clip. Now, uh, there's two things that is in this video. One is to showcase the thinking, the belief, the, the worldview, perhaps. And the other thing is to mock to make to mock that person or that worldview so i'll start the, with the second one first um i wouldn't i'm not a fan of such clip of you know literally showing someone laughing at someone else because even in terms of da'wah that's not da'wah that's not inviting that's mocking right so uh, i'm not a fan of that so so let me get it clear so i'll focus focus on only the the dialogue part right so I, I'm not a fan for that one. Yeah, but that's the clip. I, I'm not promoting it. I'm yeah. I just saw it and yeah. That's that's the original clip. But in terms of let's just see the dialogue. Can God become somebody that's weak, that's unintelligent, that is feeble, that doesn't have a clue what's going on? So that is a similar question that I have asked before in this channel. To Christian, right? But when they say that, why cannot you see God coming as a man, and God already have come as a bush, some something like that, right? So fundamentally, I I ask, okay, wait, wait, wait what? You you believe that God can become or can come in a form of such weak, limited thing? So it doesn't make sense to me, but. So I, I was wondering, okay, does all Christians believe like this or is it embedded in the belief itself that that's, that's how Christians see unlimited, right? When they say, you are limiting God. Unlimited means God can die, God can get diarrhea, etc. I'm not saying about God like this. But from Christian perspective, that is unlimited. This, this is how I perceive what they are saying, right? Because it, so, God can become cat, goat, cow, etc. If God chooses to. Uh, what? So, so it's 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 mind blowing to me, right? So, yeah, this is about. I I, I don't know whether this discussion have of course from someone who define God as God and God would never become something like this such belief is bizarre but I do wonder of course if you are a Christian if there's um, any mistake in my perception feel free to correct me but I do wonder if you happen to be non-Muslim and non-Christian what do you think about that concept? Right, what do you think about that concept? if you are not influenced by you know because of course, Muslim have a the certain basis of um, belief, and Christianity has a certain basis of belief, right? But outside of these two, which concept is making more sense to you? This is an honest question. But unfortunately, I do not have a big uh, demography of outside of Muslim and Christian that watch my video, right? If you are, I don't know, if you are Buddhist, if you are Hindu, if you are an atheist, which of the two will you make more sense? relatively speaking between the two feel free to comment i'm i'm interested to know the perspective of a total un outsider yeah that's it for this video i'm interested this is just my curiosity thank you for watching see you next time